What is going on my boys? It is Comet Chaos here and in the last video we faced off against Toriel, spared her, and now we are heading out into the under into the underground. Yep. Alright, I saved. I'm gonna go back to the ruins. And get the hell out of here. Because I don't know. I don't know why really Frisk wants to go out so bad. He's like, go mama, let me go outside. And she's like, no. And you have to fight her. But hey, you know what? We're going out anyways. To infinity and beyond. It's actually really creepy. There's like no music. I'm high key scared. See, like, um, I haven't gone past this point because Oh, actually, I think I have. Yeah, I talk. clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you feel pretty great. You didn't kill anybody this time. What will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die. Until you tire of trying, what will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up an entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it? I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't re re regicide? This is so much more interesting. Wow. You're creepy. Bye bye, Flowey. So that just happened. I mean, now this is where I, I stopped. I didn't, I didn't go any more further than this. Undertale by Toby Fox. Okay. Whoa. This is creepy. What do I do? <laughs> I just keep walking. Oh, what the hell was that? Oh, jeez. Oh no. Whoa! What was that? You saw that? I'm fucking scared. Jesus Christ. Oh no. Oh, oh geez, oh geez. Please don't do it. Please don't do it. <clears throat> Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. <laughs> okay, this is Sans, right? Yeah. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion trick in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyway, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thing. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars way too wide to stop anyway. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> well, that's convenient. Look at that, it's literally perfect. What's up, bro? You know what's up, brother. It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at the slam. It's really cool. You wanna look? No, I don't want I don't have time for that. If a human what what if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. And I will bathe in shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, 
You are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit around and boondoggle. <laughs> you get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've got a ton of work today. A skeleton. <laughs> uh, Sans. <laughs> Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. Sigh. He just says sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow. So, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> ah, I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. 